on LT. What? Your wife felt offended because nobody ate her spaghetti. You know what, sir? Let me let me go and bring it down to you, sir. Hey, let me just be real to you. Why every time your wife cooks something, it always got to be something red? She either trying to feed us spaghetti, lasagna, even trying to give us red Kool-Aid. Hey, hey, so I'm be honest with you. From up from down south, we already taught, we always taught at a young age. We don't eat nothing from no woman that we're not married to that concern, that contains anything that looks like ketchup or tomato paste in it or tomato sauce. And every time we go to something, your wife always trying to feed me and the fellas something that got red stuff in it. I don't want your wife spaghetti. I don't want her lasagna. Give me some chicken. No, if you want, if you want to ball out, cook some steak. I don't. We don't want no spaghetti. But you know what? We 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 didn't really think about it. To one of the soldiers, she said, "Sergeant Major, you not eat that. It's not good for you." And she's from Haiti. That's my soldier from Haiti. She told me not to eat it. I ain't eating it. And then then and then I, I always wonder about your wife because then she always like, "Hey, where y'all hair brushes at? I want to see what type of hair brushes y'all use so I can get one for my husband." Again, my Haitian soldier told me, don't let her get none, don't let her get none of your hair. So I don't know what the hell your wife got going on, but no, no, we we not eat nothing. And I, you know, and I told my mom about it. My mama said, boy, don't you eat that shit? That's called red eye soup. Don't want none of it. So if your wife end up feeling because we don't want to eat her spaghetti, tell her she'll get the fuck over it.